microwave. It's saying on the screen that it needs service. Keypad short. Something like that. Or your keypad just isn't functioning. First, you're going to come up here. Easy fix. Come up here. Make sure you're unplugged. Unplugged. Two screws on this model. I already have them almost all the way out. There's one. There's two. This piece here. Push a little off. So you push it to the left and you pull it. These little clips right here, I'm going to show you. See the clip? That clip goes into that slot and it slides to the right. Undo, slide to the left. One screw holds this keypad on right here. Take that off. Now, the keypad is going to come off. Again, make sure you're unplugged. Keypad up and out. Right here. See that ribbon? Ribbon over time. So this ribbon right here connects right into this slot. All you're going to do is give it a little wiggle, a little push in. Now at this point, put it back on, lock it back into place. Now you can try it. So what I'm going to do, try it, lights come back on, and there we go. Time's fixed. Put your screws back in. Make sure you click that. No service call, here's your fix right here. Danny's Home, LLC. Check all my videos. I only have two right now, as of right now. This is gonna go back in. See the slot, and it's gonna slide. So making sure it slides in, lock back in, put your two screws back in, and you're done. GE Microwave, with this style keypad right here, saying that the keypad, either the keypad doesn't work or it's saying service. First, try just unplugging it, plugging it back in. 30 seconds a minute, and there you go. Fixed.